Hey Chickies, welcome back to Vlogtober Day 15. Today I thought we would test out some products from Five Below. I know it's been, I think a few months since I've uploaded one of these videos and I thought now would be the perfect time, especially because I found a couple of nostalgic items. In case you're new here, I'm Christine. I'm currently participating in Vlogtober where I will be uploading a video every single day for the month of October. I would greatly appreciate it if you please subscribe to my channel. I would absolutely love it if you'd be a part of the Chicky crew. Also, hit that bell to be notified of new videos. So if you haven't seen my whole testing out five below gadgets playlist, I will link it right up here in the card area. All the products I'm going to be sharing today are all $5. The first one I wanted to mention, when you see this, you're going to know exactly why I picked it up. An AirPod case, but I mean, it's marble. That is the main reason why I ended up purchasing it. It says it's convenient to charge, secure case, and it says 360 full coverage. From the packaging, the only thing I could tell that was missing, you know, the little attachment on the side so you can clip it to your purse, which I currently have on mine. Really find it useful. The packaging is plastic. It's also quite slippery. That's the reason why I ended up getting a case for my AirPods because the AirPod case itself is quite slippery. So snap this into place. It goes this way. Yep. Just like that. It's cute, it's marble, and it just snapped right in place. My only gripe I would say about this is that it's slippery. So for me, I'm really scared that this thing is gonna fall out of my purse or it's just gonna slide out of my pocket or something. So this next item I thought was so nostalgic. It's actually from the brand Room to Room, which I'm guessing is the Five Below brand, but it is a plasma ball. How many of you guys remember plasma balls? I always thought these were so interesting. This was $5 and I'm curious. Is this plastic? This is what it looks like. It's plastic. This required four AAA batteries and now it's the moment of truth. We are going to switch this on. I'm actually going to turn off my ring light so that you guys can see it. Uh, works. right that is pretty cool you can feel like a bit of the heat whoa so comment below if you had a plasma ball or if you had this next item this was also five dollars it's essentially a starlight projector now i definitely have my doubts about it but i was just still really intrigued it has little tiny stars then at the very top you can see there's a moon cutout so this requires three double a batteries so i put in the batteries now let's press oh it's already it's already on two switches on here one says led and the other one says star so let me turn off the ring light press led I mean, yeah, you can see the stars and the moon. Okay, let's turn this off. Oh, there we go. Just put it down here on the table and this is what you'll see projected on the ceiling. Actually on camera, it looks like it's a little bit brighter, but in person, it's a little bit more faint. So recap on the three items we picked up today, whether they are a dash or a pass. On the marble AirPods case, I think if you're looking for one that's marble, I would say dash to your local five below and pick it up. What I'm looking for in a case, I want something that has some grip and also something that has hook here so I can hang on to it and feel a little bit more secure. So for me, I'm gonna say this is a pass. As for the plasma ball, this is the one item that I was really impressed with, especially for the price point of $5. It actually works, it's not super, super bright, but if you have always wanted a plasma ball, this is a very inexpensive one. And it's just really cool because it actually works. So I would say dash to your local five Honestly, below. We have the starlight projector. Honestly, I was a bit disappointed with this because I thought it would be a lot brighter than what was projecting on the ceiling. Really wasn't a fan of the LED. However, the regular light, I will say it was really pretty, but it was just a bit too dim. This is definitely a pass, but if you're in the market and looking for one, maybe your kids want one, 
then I would say dash to your local five below. So let me know, what did you think of today's items? Will you be dashing to your local five below and picking some of these up or will you be passing on them? And which item was your favorite? I would love to get your feedback. I hope you enjoyed today's video and found it helpful. If you did, please make sure you give this video a like. Subscribe if you already haven't. I would love for you to be a part of the Chicky crew. Make sure you come back tomorrow for Vlogtober day 16. Thank you Chicky so much for watching. Have an amazing day and I will see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Mwah.